Thanks for joining me on Fear No Art. My name is Elizabeth Alfano. Come with me as I go behind the scenes and get into the hearts and minds and souls of the creative genius. International writer Sarah Paretsky is known for transforming the mystery novel through the creation of her hot-tempered and fiercely independent female private investigator V.I. Warshawski. There's a new V.I. Warshawski novel out this January called Breakdown, and it begins in an abandoned cemetery with a dead body still warm to the touch. I recently caught up with Ms. Paretsky and asked her just how her iconic female detective character came to be. I was uh, working for CNA Insurance in downtown Chicago, and we were in a meeting, and my lips were saying, oh, Fred, heck of an idea, and the balloon over my head was saying something unprintable. And really, literally, in that moment, looking down at the dead trees in Grant Park, VI came to me. I, I thought, I don't want, like, you know, a male detective in drag. I want a woman who's like me and my friends. She's doing the job that didn't exist when we were in high school, right. but she's saying what's in the balloon over her head because she doesn't worry about what they think of her or getting fired. I'd been reading crime fiction since I was uh, in my early teens, and then when I got to be in my 20s and saw the way in which women's lives were really stereotyped in crime fiction, we were victims or we were vamps, if you were sexually active, you were wicked. If you were sexually chaste, you were good, but you couldn't do anything. The only women who could act were wicked women. And I, I really rebelled against that, that very constricting kind of stereotype of women, but it took me a really long time, eight years from when I first thought, I want a woman who, who turns the table on these images. Mm -hmm. it took me that long to, to get to a point where I felt confident about trying to write. Well, she's such a fiery character, and you've detailed her so minutely. I went on your website and I saw that you had written a horoscope for right, her. Right, that was really fun. It was one of these online things, free online horoscope, and and it just described her so much that she was restless, that she had a, a high standard for integrity and justice. and. I thought, wow, you know, these horoscopes are so good. And then I looked up um, George Bush's horoscope and it said he was a friendly person who tried to do right by everyone. And I thought, well, maybe these horoscopes aren't so accurate after all. <laughs> well, I, I think of you when I uh, think in my head a famous quote that I love, and so I will tell it to you now. Eunice Shriver, I believe, said, well-behaved women don't change the world. So I really appreciate what you've done. There's an artist and a creative spirit around every corner and in every alleyway. Join me on the next Fear No Art as we go behind the scenes and get into the unique and fascinating world of the independent artist. Well, it's a great pleasure, Elizabeth. Thanks a lot. And Fear No Art. Yes. <laughs>